Welcome to Carrie's Tutorials. I'm Simeon Grace. I'm going to show you my maxi dress in this tutorial and I'll be using three yards of Ankara fabric. It doesn't mean you have to limit your style to just Ankara fabric alone. And the measurements we'll be needing are the under bust measurement, half length and the full length of the dress. We'll be needing the shoulder measurement, the bust circumference and the under bust circumference measurement. Don't forget we upload the cutting and sewing of our tutorial separately. So if you're watching the cutting, there is need to watch the sewing tutorial. And if you're watching the sewing, there's also need for you to watch the cutting tutorial. Don't forget to click the subscribe button. Click the bell as well to get notified each time we upload a new video. Also, don't forget to watch Celebrity Halo on Ninja Int TV. And I promise you, you're going to enjoy it. Click the subscribe button and click the bell in order to get notified. So, let's move to the cutting table. <laughs> Welcome back. I'm going to start from the back. For the back, I only um, cut out a fabric like a facing to turn it. I also did that to the front. So what I'm going to do from here is to join. I'm going to join it. Then I'll notch and top stitch on this. Then I'll come back to hold the darts. Let's move on. <laughs> So this is the front and I'm going to bring those two together to join and also on the other side I'll bring this to join. Okay, so we've joined those two together.
And the next thing we are going to do is to join also because I cut out um, like a facing just to turn it. So I'm going to arrange it as well. I cut for each of the space. So I'm going to arrange it and then I'll join it just the same way I've joined the fabric. I'll join the pieces together as well. All right, I've, I've arranged this. So I'm just going to join this two together and I'll as well join this together. So we move to the band. I'll have to fix the band first before joining this to turn for using this to turn um, the edges. So let's join first. the back the band can just leave little space so as to turn it inside out so i'll need to hang on this first before we continue still working on the front first the 1.5 out of the 2.5 inches that we had it which is an extra i'll fold in 1.5 inches the remaining one inch on this side and on this side will serve as the button and the button host that will overlap after that i'll come with the band i'll just fix the band this way then i'll come with the facing i'll place it so i can turn um the edge so whatever i do here i will also repeat on the other side
okay so this is what we have on one side so I'll repeat the same on the other side and afterwards we're going to have it like this so let's move on Right, having done that, the next thing I'm going to do is to bring out the shape. So I'll join the sides together by bringing bringing the front and the back together. That's this is the front and this is the back. So I'll bring out the shape. Okay, so bringing out the shape. I'll just go with my circumference measurement divided by 2. The bust is 34 divided by 2 is 17. So I have 19, which means I have 2 inches excess. 1 inch on this side and 1 inch on this side. On the other side is what I'll use to fold. And as well, I have the other bust circumference measurement 26 divided by 2 is 13. And I have 16. That means I have 3 inches excess. So I took 1.5 and also 1.5 on the other side. Then I'll join. Um, I'm still coming back. This is going to be the final thing and I might not be showing it in this tutorial. It's, um, I'll be using Emin gum to hold this. That's the facing. And I have a tutorial on how to use Emin gum. You can as well check my video on that. How to use Emin gum. So that's what I'll be using to um, finish this, the hedges, both the front and the back. So let's move on. Alright, so we've joined that, then we move to the base. To form our gathers, we need to first run a straight sewing. I've done that, as you can see. So, I'll just pull one of the fabric, and um, one of the thread, 
to gather my fabric and after that i'll join it to the half length which we already have and we continue from there that's how you pull just pick one of the threads to pull just to get your gathers all right so i've done that the next thing i'm going to do is to join this and this is my fabric which is the half length first i need to fold in a little part of the gathered fabric i need to fold it in so i can use it to turn or just turn it inside just like this all right so and don't forget we still need to fold or we're still going to fold this part of our dress we are still going to fold this part to continue um the button and the button holes so that as well is included <coughs> putting it let me just uh, put it this way so you can understand this is what we are going to this is what we are going to have afterwards so and that's the 1.5 inches to form the fabric and um, to f to get i mean to fold the 1.5 so i'm going to leave it and use it to turn just like this i use it to turn then from here i'll continue to gather my fabric so i'll also leave the space on the other side the other end of the dress of the fabric so as to use it to turn as well So the next thing I'm going to do from there is to continue to fold just like we folded the upper part so I'll just continue to fold it.
having folded that um we still go back to the band actually we ought to have attached this to the back just like the way i did here at the front that's what we should have done but i forgot so i'll just um hold it down and it's not a problem to lose we can actually lose so that this will go inside but for this for the sake of this tutorial i'll just hold it down so that we can continue and move to the next thing all right so i'll just hold it down that's our band and in case you want to lose that means you just open up a space here to insert this then you close it back so i'll come back to that and the last thing we are which we're going to do in this tutorial and is to fold in the base of our dress so i'll just fold it like this as i'm going to fold and all this inside there's need for us to weave i'll weave and like i said i'll use my emming gum to finish the hedges here so you can always watch how to use emming gum i have that tutorial just type how to use emming gum that is going to help you and like i said we upload the cutting and sewing of our tutorial separately so if you're watching this there's need for you to watch how to cut each time you watch how to sew kindly watch how to cut as well and if you're yet to watch our movie celebrity taylor i'm still telling you you need to watch that interesting movie on niger in tv the link is on the description let's move on well 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 i guess this is the last thing to do on this tutorial don't forget to like to subscribe on our tv and you can leave your comments in the so comment section below and like i said if this is your first time on this channel kindly click the subscribe button click the bell as well so as to get notified each time we upload a new video also like a new movie channel niger Inc. tv all right so remember to do all the necessary things in your dress that's the last thing to do and till i see you next class bye now so yeah you're